One of the things that's really important in today's world is being able to organize and assimilate your ideas. And mind maps are a great way to do that. I've used mind maps for years. However, I recently found a different solution because what I found is a lot of the old mind map solutions are pretty expensive and they've all gone to this subscription model. And so I found a solution. You're not going to have to pay that. But Mind Mind Manager is certainly one of the uh, leaders in the field. And um, it is a little bit more corporate style. Um, and it certainly has a, a lot of features, but it's a little bit confusing. They've got professional, they've got essential, they've got add-ons. So it feels a little messy. And they have the annual plan, which is uh, $200, uh, 200 euros for the one-time purchase for 400 euros. Okay. So this is quite an expensive software to use, and it's not even the, the best. Another one that I've used and I was using up until recently is Mindomo. And this one used to have a one-time price and then they moved to the subscription model. The one I, I had doesn't update, but if you want to get online and, uh, and do this, then, um, and you want to have the, the resources and the up-to-date, then you're looking at, at some of these different options here. So, uh, five, 13 and 16 a month. These are just for single users, keep in mind. And they do have AI credits, which allow you to kind of use AI to help stimulate the brainstorming session. A lot of them do have a limit free option, but the limitation is really three diagrams. And if you're going to use a software, particularly like a mind mapping software, you're going to find that limitation of three is really restrictive for what you want to do. A lot, another option that I want to show you is, is this one. And again, a collaborative mind mapping, great options here. It's a little bit more bold, a little bit more colorful. Uh, when it comes to the pricing, again, you have three, this is with MindMeister, uh, which I've used in the past, three uh, mind maps or the personal is six or the pro is teams. And when you think about that, particularly when you're doing things with, with teams, you're paying per user. So you're having multiple users. It can get really expensive very fast. However, I found one that I think you're going to like, and it's available right now for just a one-time price. I'm not going to keep you in suspense here. $29. That's it. It really makes a lot of sense just once and you're done. They have the, the desktop versions, the mobile versions, all that stuff. And you, you can put on circles and notes, and this is really good for particularly for collaborating, where you can draw that stuff in and does all these organizational charts, fish bones, class diagrams. And you can, as I said, use sticky notes. You can reach consensus by voting. I like this because you know, if you're collaborating on something, you can have a countdown and then you, you force everyone to make a decision, a collaborative decision. And that's really good because limitation, anytime you put a limitation on something, it helps get things moving and get things completed. So they have stickers and emojis and all that kind of stuff, all the platforms. They also have AI, so it can really help you to come up with new ideas when you feel stuck and that sort of thing. So I really like board mix. It's fun to use. The pricing here is, again, it's got that subscription, but I'm going to put a link in the, sorry, not as, as, as it's got the subscription. I'm going to put a link in the description because there is a one-time availability and you'll definitely want to check that out, BoardMix. It's a really great platform for mind mapping and it's just something that I think would, would really help when you plan things out. And this is the one thing that I want to add about, now, particularly with AI, it allows you to accomplish so much more. But when you think about the inputs, when you think about the prompts, when you think about the thought that goes into it, you need to be more careful and more strategic in the thinking phase when you're using any AI applications. So I'll put the link to board mix in the description, check it out. And if you used it, let me know what I think, let, let me know what you think in the comments. All right, that's it. Check out the link in the description.